The Star Wars blog, Bespin Bulletin, is reporting that Star Wars Skeleton Crew has begun filming in California. The series, which follows a group of kids lost in space trying to find their way back home, was officially announced at Star Wars Celebration and was set for release in 2023. Now that we know production has begun, we might even be able to guess when we might see the final product. I want to make it clear, I am fully speculating here, but there are some interesting patterns we can consider. The first and second seasons of The Mandalorian began production in October 2018 and 2019. Season 1 premiered in November 2019 and Season 2 in late October 2020. Obi-Wan Kenobi began shooting in April 2021 and released in May 2022, 13 months later. So we have a pretty consistent cycle of premiere dates set one year and one month after the start of production. So if Skeleton Crew began in late June or early July, we might be looking at an August 2023 premiere. I will point out that Andor is the outlier when it comes to Disney Plus series. It began shooting in November 2020 and won't release until the very end of August 2022, so we're looking at 21 or 22 months, but it also had more on-location shoots and is a longer season than any other series we've seen so far, coming in at 12 episodes. And I also have to point out that the Star Wars lineup is getting more and more crowded. I don't think Disney is going to be releasing everything as soon as it's done anymore. They probably never have, but they will need to be more strategic about their releases. We're already going to be doubling up with Andor and The Bad Batch later this year. The Mandalorian Season 3 began filming in October 2021 and ended in March 2022, but we know it's not going to premiere until February 2023, so now we're looking at a 16 month turnaround instead of 13. Not a huge difference, but something to take into account. So our 2023 schedule might look something like The Mandalorian from February to April, Ahsoka from June to August, and then maybe Skeleton Crew will round out the year from October to December. And that's just shows in the Mandoverse. We know we're getting a second volume of Star Wars Visions, probably more Bad Batch and more Tales of the Jedi, Young Jedi Adventures, and probably more. 2023 is going to be big Busy for sure. I recently rewatched Stranger Things as a refresher for season four, which I loved by the way, and I'm psyched to see something similar in Star Wars. Just because a show is about kids doesn't mean it can't be enjoyed by adults as well, and producer John Watts said exactly that at Star Wars Celebration. It's about kids, but it's not a kids show. I expect it to have a similar tone as The Mandalorian, Ahsoka, and the other shows of the post-Return of the Jedi era. But that's it for today. I'm just excited to see more Star Wars in production, and I'm very curious to see how 2023 shakes out with so much on the horizon. If you haven't already, please like this video, subscribe to the channel, follow us on TikTok, Twitter, and Instagram, and consider checking out our Patreon page. As always, thanks for watching, and may the Force be with you.